हेलो हाय एवरीवन सो वी आर गोइंग टू अंडरस्टैंड द सिलेबस फॉर एस ए पी एम एम कोर्स ओके सो टू व्यू द सिलेबस यू हैव टू विजिट एस ए पी सर्टिफिकेशन हब डॉट कॉम वेबसाइट ओके हियर यू विल बी एबल टू सी मल्टीपल कोर्सेस एज ऑफ नाउ इट इज़ ओनली वन कोर्स विच इज फॉर एस ए पी एम एम सो दिस इज़ अ लाइव कोर्स Uh, for SAP MM uh, uh, online course by myself Rishikesh Kaule, okay, which is starting on twenty sixth of twenty twenty three. Okay, so when I click on this, so you will be able to see uh, the details of the course. Here is the fees. So this fees is included only for the learning and not for the SAP Global certification. SAP Global certification, you have to go to the SAP. Uh, um, sai sap website you have to pay the money and do the certification okay <clears throat> and uh, the next thing is uh, you have the details about this course now course is starting on 26th uh, 2023 alternate days for 60 to 70 days evening 9:30 ist and 7 ksa okay so every time uh, the time and things will be updated here for a new batch and new course okay uh then this course uh, requirements are written here then who can learn it is written here any fresher software engineers who has a knowledge of maybe as a bit technical he want to shift to functional so he can learn or uh, anyone who is interested okay to learn sap they can come here and uh, just subscribe uh, at uh, like add to basket and uh, they can start learning okay as per the schedule <clears throat> so here is uh, what will you learn okay here it is all written in short and then we can see the course content this is your syllabus now in course content uh, it is very beautifully designed uh, it is designed by myself uh, so here you will start from very basics and you will go to a level of consultant so very basic is uh you can understand like why learn sap mm why to learn sap mm how it is taught in this particular course how to install the software how to access fury okay for free means sap is providing the access so it is for free then um, uh, wh- how to check fury uh, apps and all of these things all details so we will start from the very basic so anyone who is knowing uh, who is not knowing anything it is fine no problem you will get to know everything about sap from your sap mm so after this we start for the implementation like wh- how the implementation is done and uh, oh, when you go to a company to implement sap so what are the methods and what uh, steps are there in particular methods and how they are executed then while implementation what documents are required these all documents we have we also have the attachments which you can download and then you can use it for maybe when you get a job you can use it in your implementations uh, itself <clears throat> then we have enterprise structure here from here actually we start to understand about the domain uh of uh, in uh, actually the industry and then the sap uh, for uh, structure is like uh, there is a company then we have multiple plants all of these things i will be t- uh, teaching or giving a overview of the, uh, these things then the transactions what transactions are there major transaction sap uh, like uh, purchase requisition purchase uh, quotation purchase order goods received invoice verification here we are going to just understand it the business process i have written so we will understand the business process where how what are the scenarios in this particular transaction these things then we come for sap hands on now we will start doing it into sap so how the purchase requisition is created in sap the whole detail then the reports in gui the reports in fury all of these things this we will do for all of the transactions so after doing this you will get a very good hands on on the basic transactions of procurement then we'll uh, understand the master data okay material master all of the master data <clears throat> then we will start doing the 
business process which is domestic procurement import service and all of these here we will do we will first understand what is domestic process or any of the process then we will start doing the transactions in sap so you will first uh, so you will get a better idea then we also have inventory management a part of sap mm so we will see what are the types of uh, uh, transactions we need to execute in inventory management and we will also perform that then physical inventory all of these then migration cockpit and lsmw is something when you do a implementation you need to migrate the data so how the data is migrated what are the templates how the steps are to be followed everything we are going to do in detail <clears throat> then the configurations configurations for sap mm so after doing all of the configurations uh, we also have interview questions so you can go there and uh, 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 take a quiz of interview questions and after this i'll just add one more thing which is uh, the exam questions sap certification exam questions practice questions so you can uh, just execute or you can take that particular uh, exam and you can practice it maybe multiple times and then you can uh, go and um <clears throat> get the sap certification by taking the sap exam from sap website itself okay